on, give me a drink. How? How yourself? <laughs> say, friendly Indian, what do those drums I heard outside say? Drums say, boom. <laughs> I mean, do they give any message? Yeah, they say, big buffalo hunt. You want to watch them buffalo hunt? What for? Those buffalo never catch anything. A lot of you out there have been writing in saying, how come you guys never have any contests? Well, we want you to know that we hear you. And tonight, I'm proud to announce the first annual Shanana Drawing Contest. Now, all you got to do is draw a picture of us. Shanana, to the best of your ability, just send it in. The grand prize is, get this, a free, all-expense-paid trip to Paris, France, and Europe, too, for nothing. <laughs> so please send in those pictures, because we could sure use that trip to Europe. Hey, Bird Brain! Hey, Bowser, she's calling you. Oh, thanks, Donnie. What is it, lady? I think you should know I wrote to the president asking him to declare your vocal cords a disaster area. Very funny. I'll have you know that our melodious voices are insured by Lloyds of London for $25,000. Right, yeah. If I were you, I'd collect. Yeah. <laughs> to tell you the story about a Mary Lou. I mean, the kind of a woman make a fool of you. She make a young man grow and an old man pain. The way she took my money was a cry and shame. She took my diamond ring. She took my watch and chain. She took the keys to my Cadillac car. Jumped in my kitty and she drove afar. She drove up. She heard me show. I had a 55 Ford and a $2 bill. The way she took 
that man gave me a chill. She took on my diamond ring. She took on my watch and chain, Lord. She took the keys to my Cadillac car and jumped in my kitty and she drove afar. Yeah, she jumped in my kitty and she drove afar. Oh, Mary. Oh, Mary, Mary. Oh, Mary Lou, what you trying to do? Oh, Mary, Mary, I've been looking for you. Oh, Mary, 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 what you trying to do? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to be honest with you. It's not always easy getting guest stars for this show. However, once in a long while, a big star really wants to be on our show. Jay Johnson and Squeaky are just such stars. And right now, they're waiting backstage just dying to come out here and entertain. I am going to ask you just one more time. Are you going to do the show or not? <laughs> well... We're never gonna do your stupid show! Uh, uh, Squeaky, maybe... Maybe we'd better talk about this thing. I mean, uh, I don't want to be, uh, unreasonable about it. Give him some more. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Jay Johnson and Squeaky have been wanting to do this show for a long time. Wow! So, without further ado, here they are, Jay Johnson and Squeaky! quite ready yet. So, while we're waiting, let me tell you a little bit about them. Squeaky started his career in California as a surfboard. This isn't working. Ah, I think we'd better let Lenny have a crack at no, him. No, not, not at Lenny. Come on, get on that fat bucket of lard. We can take it. <laughs> you mean we. <laughs> oh, food. Please, I mean, you, you haven't let me eat in three days. Come on, I haven't eaten my whole life. You want to eat? You do the show. Come on, Squeaky, let's do the lousy show. I mean, can't be all that bad. Oh, come on, have you seen the show? I know, dummy. These guys think that they can sing. Hey, enough talk. Are you going to do the show or not? Yes. No. Hey, good. I was hoping this wouldn't work. <laughs> then, in 1964, Squeaky had to retire for several months when he developed a severe case of termites. <laughs> He's not cracking. Uh, uh, oh, then let's try the old tempt him with a chick trick. Tanya, baby, uh. you're on. <laughs> Hiya, Jay. Lonely. Let me help you forget your wife and kids. All you have to do is be on the show. You know, Squeaky, this might open up a whole new world for us. Yeah, get lost, Bindo. Well, I never. Oh, I bet you did. <gasps> Why are you going to get a kid? Uh, do what you want, Bindo. You can't scare us. Uh -uh. Oh, no? What if I was to pull his arm out of your back, huh? Hey, where's the stage good, buddy? <laughs> hey, 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 what happened to our pride? Are you kidding? An idiot dummy that I know dummy. <laughs> <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's have a big shot on our welcome for Jay Johnson and Squeaky! <laughs> Uh, Grease for peace, Squeak. Thank you. You know, your hair dries real fast. <laughs> I just realized there was no oil shortage before Sean and I got on the air. Did you realize that? Hey. Uh, is that true? I wouldn't say that. Yeah, I mean, you really look at these guys. Oh, you, you think they have something to do with it? Yeah, they must have the connection in the Middle East, for sure. Yeah. Connection? Yeah, they're all at oil. And why else would they call themselves the Shah of Nana? All right. <laughs> You're gonna get us killed. Not us, just you. I know. <laughs> uh, right, anyway, you know. no, see, Sean and I is doing us a great service. It's true. That's right. They're keeping alive the roots of rock music. I don't know about the right. roots, definitely the dirt. Now, look. Hey. Uh, but you see, uh, 50s music is very important. Yes, yes. One thing very important to 50s music was the lyric. Yeah, things like this. Yeah. Ooh, ee, ooh, ah, ah, ding, ding, oh, the ding, bing, bang. Yeah, yeah, things like that. <laughs> that was great. Hey, really? That was great. Right. Great lyrics. 
Yeah, but it kissed your heart out more than Hanley's. Yeah, that was very great lyric. And also, a very important part of the 50s music was the echo chambers. They know that. Well, I'm telling you. Okay, I, I remember. Do you remember the 50s music? Sure. You were around? Yeah, count the rings on my neck. Okay. <laughs> anyway, echo chamber is very important. So today, we're going to imagine that, that we have an echo chamber. Yeah. You called the imaginary sound man up there. Is that what he is? That's, that's him. You say, hello. Hello. Hello, how are you? Fine. Uh, can you give us the echo? All right, here it is. Thank you. Okay, wait a minute. We do it. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. I think it's a little too big. Dig, dig, dig. What? Not too much, not too much. Turn it, 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 what? And I can't stop. Oh, no, 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 no. I can't either. What are you going to do? Do I don't know. How many? What? How am I going to do? What? <laughs> that did it. Okay, we're back to normal. Hey, oh, hey. Hey, nice ball set. Very nice ball <laughs> The best things in life are free. But you can give them to the birds and bees. I need mine. What I want. That's 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 what I want. Gentlemen, I've just closed the biggest deal in the history of our great corporation. Tomorrow morning, we start be the greatest engineering feat of all time, but I've worked out all the details. One crew will start digging from New York, while simultaneously another crew will be digging from England. Somewhere in the middle of the Atlantic, the two crews will meet, and bingo, we've got our subway. Uh, I have a question, AF. What happens if the two crews don't meet? It's even better. We'll have two subways. <laughs> But your love don't pay my bills. I need mine. That's what I want. 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 Gentlemen, gentlemen, I'm afraid we're in the midst of our worst year ever. Yes, is that bad? In answer to my son, the vice president's question, yes, it's bad, extremely bad. Profits are down, oh, sales are down, oh, oh, investments are down, oh, and worst of all, I've got a pain right here. Oh, well, let's perhaps we take a look at our overseas investments and sales, the problem oh. will become clearer. As you can see, the overseas sales are absolutely abysmal. They don't look so bad to me. Uh, they don't. Well, sorry, my mistake. Hey. Now let's hear some ideas how to improve sales. Ideas. Yes, Sonny. I turned the graph upside down again. <laughs> and they said, don't hire relatives. Meeting adjourned. Money don't get everything is true. But what it don't get, I can't use. I need mine. That's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want. Yeah, I just got the sales figures for the last quarter. Yeah. We've got to do something about this. Yeah. Any suggestions? I have an idea. How about we do this? Yeah. Don't be a dummy. Well, yeah, we did that in the last black and it wasn't funny there either. Yeah. No, no, no. I think there's only one way we can keep this company from going bankrupt. Right. 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 Each of us is insured for two million dollars. One of us will have to kill himself to keep the company solvent. Yeah, good idea. Oh. Can I have a volunteer? Let me do it, boss. Please, I want to do it. Oh. Talk about a yes man. Son of you, you're doing a fine thing. And smart, too. I mean, this is the kind of thing that'll look really good on your record. Yeah. Thanks, boss. Yeah. OK, Donahue, may I escort you? 
Gentlemen, I'm sure we're all touched by Donahue's contribution. Yeah. And I think we owe him a vote of confidence. You betcha. Yeah. One, One, two, three. Sucker! paint this joint. Yeah, you told yeah. me about that already, but you guys couldn't decide on a color. Yeah, well, the ten of us have reached a consensus as to color. Great. What color? Pink. Yeah. <laughs> Pink is for girls. How else do you expect us to get them? <laughs> With their luck, they'll get flamingos. Yeah. Hey, Jocko, there's Ginger. She's leaving Donnie's house with a big smile on her face. Hey, what could that mean? It only mean one thing. Donnie wasn't home. <laughs> Everybody, what it is? What's up? We're up in the morning, out on the job. Work like the devil Us with my woman, toil for my kids, work till I'm wrinkled and gray. Time once again for the Shanana Joke Hall of Fame. And now for this week's classic joke. A beautiful girl goes to a psychiatrist and says, Doctor, I can't hold my liquor. Two drops of booze and I take off all my clothes and become wild and passionate. The doctor says, 
This sounds serious. Let's have a couple of drinks and talk it over. <laughs> well, that's it for our show tonight. We want to give a special thanks to Jay Johnson for being even funnier than us. Oh, and Jay, in answer to your question, no, doing this show does not entitle your career to carry federal disaster insurance. <laughs> I want you to think about those immortal words spoken by King Arthur at the first meeting of the Knights of the Round Table. <clears throat> Two heads are better than one. <laughs> Except when you have to buy hats. <laughs> Good night and grease for peace. <laughs>